Hey, it's on the part 19. Last episode, what happened? I apparently could start Pokemon battles just by catching the chat with people. But what happened? What happened? Uh, let's see. A giant laser burst out of the middle of the sea, which apparently was caused by a drill. Because I just realized I'm in a really bad matchup right now. It's He'll be fine, Air Lace. Air, air, air on, air, 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 alien. Alien race. It's an alien race. Aerolot, Aerolot, Aerial, Air, Aler, Aler, A, 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 stop, you're gonna hurt yourself. <laughs> Look, just, just stop while you're behind. It's okay, don't worry. We forgive you. You're really concerned about that one square around you. Nothing else. He's just like, as long as I got this one little square. But I'm, I'm super fast. Can I just fly around? No, no. You must burst through that square. And once you burst through that little square, you will know inner peace. I want you to define inner peace for me. It's like... Snap! Okay, so... 80. As much as I've wanted to do the Fury Cutter with the metronome, just kind of like let yourself build up and then when he gets back, get out. Exizer is... They really improved the Fury Cutter from when it was started. It's way more powerful now, but... Okay, doing the math. 60, 120, as opposed to 120, 120. So it's going to take three turns for Fury Cutter to become more powerful. Or you can just kill things. Okay, we're going to go with Exizer. Please forgive me. I love Fury Cutter. Fury Cutter definitely is an awesome move. Why do I have a Marill? It's like, it's, it's, I don't even know. It's like I blacked out for some reason. I got a Marill, apparently. <laughs> why do I have a Marill? That is why I have a Marill. <laughs> it's like, hang, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Oh yeah, because I won't want to put all those on my dearly beloved, dearly beloved Swampert, Marshtop, Mudkip, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Did you just call him your dearly beloved? It's my Mudkip. Alright, let's see what the awesome animation for X-Scissor is. Shing shing, whatcha? Well, that was cool, but... Did he just... Okay, so we know I'm not going to be able to hit him, right? We know that for a fact. So I'm just going to switch out. Not going to let me choose? Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm going to choose Shift Tree. Just to be like, ha, take that water type. Da, 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 oh. Nearly played. Yeah, second. Yeah, I do kind of feel like you know I just got amnesia and I have no idea what's going on in my game. It's been a while. Been doing other stuff, other stuff that was probably not very important in comparison to Pokemon. But I'm gonna pretend it is. What kind of other stuff? I I I don't even remember anymore. Something to do with. But what I said it was ice cream, a goblin, and a bet that we couldn't shove it up our noses napkin. Okay, everyone, just calm down. There's <laughs> all these levels up. Everyone, just calm down. Thanks, Roger. Have you ever had a tangled fishing line? I haven't gone very fishing like very much in my life, but the few times I have, that thing's tangled. It is a jerk to get off. It's like it is a nightmare. Why am I challenging every single trainer? Okay. You do that. <laughs> then why am I fighting every single trainer? Isn't there like an emergency situation going on? This could be bad. Yep, this is bad. You won't. Mm. Stupidity incarnate! I told he was just ice, so I should- Ah, man, come on. 
No! It's minty fresh! It's so minty fresh it hurts. Am I the one that gets that? Where like, you know, you're only supposed to take one tic tac and you take like five. Just cuz. Maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm the only one that takes five Kit Kats instead. Not Kit, not Kit Kats, Tic Tacs. Mask Rain. Ooh. My attack fell. That means I'm not going to be able to switch out as easy. Oh, well, this is Aileron Ace so here. Boom! Boom! No. Just... What was I saying, really? Where I take like five Tic Tacs instead of like one. And literally, like, it hurts to breathe, and your nose is, like, completely clear. And you're just like... Oh, it hurts! It hurts to breathe! Pressure is a weird ability. Just saying. It's like, it makes it so you... What is it? Like, it makes you use more power points per... Okay! We need to evac our dear friend in Jazz. The question is, do I make him switch out, or... Actually, I don't even need to make him... Wait, hold on. Yeah, I want to make him... Use Baton Pass. And then give him to... Ninja... Not Ninja... Shift Tree again. So he's just going to use Dark Pulse anyway, so he doesn't need attack. You... Everyone else needs attack, so... Alright, Dustclops. Mr. Super Cool Ghost. I like ghosts. Goes cool. Yeah, dark pose. Watch as I open my mouth. And somehow what sounds like someone taking a small machine gun to a door, you die. <laughs> yeah, I'm a rip. Real's like, I'm learning so much. I'm like, slave. Stop saying words. Slave. Evolve. How big is Muriel? Muriel's like this big? It's about a foot. I don't feel like using the power of the computer, which is right here, but I could. It's an Azimarill! That thing's adorable! And as you can see, it gained in height. Do you know what that means? What does that mean, you ask? It's quite simple. It means I'm not using a foot-tall monster to swim around anymore. No siree, I'm using a good old classic. I just realized that they're both standing on animals similar to I am. Or, she's sitting on it, I, I guess, but... The point remains! <laughs> yeah, let's see. Burn! Burn, baby, burn. Okay, and then... Gonna get a super potion. A super, super potion! <laughs> Doink. Eh, uh, yeah, do it. Do I saw metron the metronome on uh take. Yeah, I still got it. Alright, so item give You gotta figure out what to give me. Uh, not bad, nothing. Can I just give him this? It has magical powers, right? Okay, uh, that sounds good. That might work. Uh I see. King's Rock wouldn't be bad. No. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. I'm not very good at this one. No. Okay, give him the King's Rock. Actually, yeah, King's Rock would work best for him just so it's like, ha, flinch ya, sucker. Guess what that means? And they're like, what does that mean? You stink. I do need to explore his path, though. I don't want it! Wait, do I have one? Do I have one? Do I, do I have one of these things? No, I don't, actually. No, I don't. Okay, don't die! That was a poor choice of move. <laughs> yes, like, I did it! Good! <laughs> Good! Now I want to read the sign! Bird. Bird, bird, like tweet, tweet, flying. Bird, like gonna eat my ninjas alive. Yep, that's gonna eat my ninjas alive. Alright, alright. 
The plan here is very simple. First step use Pokemon. Second step, get the get out. Get that crap out. Use get that crap out Juju. And then watch shi nah, shift tree. And then watch shift tree, I mean Agron, I mean whatever this giant steel Acupressure is a weird ability. Oh no never mind, what am I thinking of? Yeah, I'm just gonna use Stone Edge. There's no need to Mega Evolve. Yeah, Acupressure is the one that like randomly raises one of their stats, right? Doink! Well, that was easy. Yeah! Ninjasu's like, I still rock! <laughs> you ran away like a little girl. Nuh-uh. Yeah, you did. <laughs> we all saw you. That's because Max told me to. No excuses. You're allowed to complain all you want, but there's no excuses. Um, okay. Okay, so I oh never mind. I thought I I thought I heard myself. So I'm gonna throw out the question that I'm gigantic monster, if I could speak clearly, made of steel. If I run into the ground or trip, it ain't gonna hurt me. It's just gonna be like, oh, I just ran into the ground or tripped. No big deal, bro, I got this. <laughs> I have no idea where I am, what I'm doing, or where I'm going. Let's not go that way. We gotta go figure out this giant hole in the everything that... Dude, this thing's huge. Is this like water I can dive in? Hey, you! Yeah! <laughs> it's a little tentacle. It's a stinking bird. Can I just ride that? I don't want to do it. But can I just ride that over the water? I'd rather ride that over the water than this weird little two foot nothing. Well, I don't even know what that thing is. Is it a bunny? Is it a, is it, I don't know what it is. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for that giant laser that, oh. Do you get paid for patrol? I'm like, no, 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 no. Get off subject, get off subject. The giant laser. <laughs> I'm looking for it. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. Please make that little square in front of you. I love that little square. I lied. Oh. No. Yeah, I guess. I think I might drown. Good. You're really just gonna stare at him, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I would love to dive. I have no idea what diving's gonna look like. Last I checked, it looked like me hanging on for dear life. Um, I was told I got Scooby Deer. Dude, it's one of those things! Hey! No, I wouldn't! I would like to grab that little guy! Whatever that munchkin's called. Hey! It's a giant thing! Now I know for a fact like if you explore down these paths. Wait, I just realized something what? There are no Pokemon on my little radar. Do you know what this means? It means I can travel freely without being nagged by a wild tentacle. Which is against normal logic because normally you would think that it's like since I'm underwater there'd be more fish trying to eat me. But perhaps that they see me as one of themselves. I really hope that isn't like my air supply going out. No! I'm looking for treasure! You really are endlessly entertained. Come, my bunny. My fairy bunny. Mr. I'm gonna call him Mr. Dude, you're right. Good. <laughs> Is this the guy from earlier that said he was drowning? Okay, the fact that there's actually a relic. Is that? Oh wait, no. Yeah, it's possible. Kalei's like, I better get my own air supply. <laughs> actually, now that I think about it, this is actually like the one situation where it makes sense that fish are like floating around, like he is right now. Man. As opposed to my Galade, who is sitting there without his scuba suit, going, dude. I'm not getting paid enough for this. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Get me back in the Pokeball. If they actually accounted for that. 
that would be the funniest and most messed up thing ever. It's like, your Pokemon can't be out for more than two turns, or else he suffocates and dies. It's like... That's brutal! This is so cool, though. I like this. I think it's the fact that I can freely move around without being, you know, hampered. Without being pampered by random Tentacruel. Excuse me, ma'am! Marine smell? Sorry. Are you, are you supposed to have your hair sticking out like that? What if the water go like through the hair and then... And well, I guess anime hair is like really thick. You know, like all the people that have like flowy locks down their back. Just like, whoosh, don't care. What's her face? She might even pop up in this game. Like she wears black and she has the blonde hair. You know what I mean? No? Okay. Stone Edge. I don't know where I'm getting this rock from, but... Meh. <laughs> <laughs> but skidoosh. Death. Take that and run with it. Bloop. Did she just die? Uh, that last stone edge punctured her air <laughs> her air canister. I have no idea where I am, and I'm just gonna walk away from that situation. You're letting her die. I'm letting her die. I should probably surface. <laughs> It's like there's like some whale or something. Boom, burst through him. Yeah! I just don't want to deal with trainers. Hey, where are those two trainers that popped up here? You just said you didn't want it. I lied. Alright, so let's go down. Yeah. So the laser came out of here first, right? Well, yeah. So you know what that means, right? Right. What if it comes again? And that sends Historia Max. Man, you died. Thanks, Dark Souls. Really appreciate that. <laughs> oh, look, it's one of those little coral thingies! You, you don't remember what that thing's called, do you? Not at all! You don't even care that much, do you? Nope! No, I don't! <laughs> Alright, so now I gotta go over here. So the thing I saw earlier was the cave entrance, but... Yeah, you know, I didn't want to go down it yet. Because... I, I think there's a good reason. <laughs> Where are you going? I, I don't actually... Good morrow, gentlemen! Dang it! Get off it. I don't want a Pelipper! I don't want a Pelipper! He's <laughs> like, what is he doing with his hands? Shh! You see... Master Max has the ability to communicate with Pokemon at the most intimate level. Intimate? He's yelling at the thing and making hand signs. Go away! Seafloor Cavern. Alright, so here's the plan. You got the science pistol? Yeah, I got the science pistol. Alright. We're gonna shoot the person, and then you're gonna shoot him in the head here so he falls backwards. We're gonna catch him, slowly lower him into the water. This is gonna be like sweet, awesome SWAT team, Navy SEAL ops special style. I'm in this mindset of I just don't want to deal with wild Pokemon, so if you don't mind, I'm just going to go to my items. I'm going to go here, find my repel, find my repel, find my repel, find my repel. Where is my, there it is. Ooh, ooh. 
Smells like bad air freshener. Yeah. It's a, it's a zoo bat. Why is there a zoo bat in the middle of this rock? Why is there a graveler in the middle? You rock smash my face! Now. I think I already got a GB. He's okay. like, now. It's true that I may have smashed your face. You may have! But, I don't think this is something we all need to get worked up over. Can we all just relax and take this in? As a Bill, did you see what he just did to me? Yeah, he rock smashed my face too! Now, Bill. Red. Let's just take this like polite adults. Maybe you shouldn't rock smash people's faces in as they're sitting down for a nice cup of mocha. Wait, hang on. Mocha? Th that's not the point! Dang. Oh! Snap, it stays on. It's nice. Hi! I have no use for children. Wait, hang on. This is the laser the site where the laser came from. And we set those traps up on purpose. And those gravelers. Yeah, they're not happy with you. And Pokemon aren't supposed to dive in here. I obviously have no use for you. This is obviously a normal occurrence. I'm like, right, it's, it's normal. <laughs> hey, Jerry. Are you fighting a Pokemon trainer? Yeah, one showed up. Maybe while you're distracting him, I should sound the alarm. No! No, it's good, brah. Got this one. You sure? I mean, I've been hearing about a kid with a Gallade who likes to power up Punch Mighty Enos. And apparently he's, he's bad news. Yeah, whatever, I'll be fine. Alright. I guess. I'll just stand up here on my other rock. Be so cool. I wanna go home. Bill, you crying about your mama. Some of you are so small and can't that makes your body hurt, but I don't mind it. Hmm. But things like way smaller than me. Okay, furthermore. If I could, I would mega evolve Marshchomp and be like, Alright Marshchomp, I want you to completely destroy this thing. 100% destroy it, or at least disable the engines. Permanently. And by permanently, I mean eat the engine. <laughs> you want me to eat the engine? Yes, eat the entire engine. Or at least, you know, like the vital points of it. You want me to eat a giant piece of metal. Shell smash! Breaks the shell sharp, which lowers its defense special defense, but sharply raises its attack special attack and speed attack. Oh, oops! I'm I don't think you know how tempting that is. I mean, like get rid of curse and put shell smash, but eh. Curse kind of just fits Torkoal better. Did they stretch? Curse just kind of fits in better because it's like, all right, we're gonna take your stats that are awesome. And make them more awesome. Okay, judging by that water right there, I'm gonna. Oh. Pardon me. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! This could be bad. No, come on. Yeah, yeah. I love how I sparkle. <laughs> The ultimate hallmark of all Pokemon games. Yeah, totally. The slider puzzle. Slider puzzle is a dangerous, dangerous enemy. Especially in areas where. So apparently I can revive my Pokemon with rocks. Anyway, I was saying words. Um, especially when the dangerous area has many different kinds of Pokemon that enjoy trying to eat your noodles. Nothing else, just your noodles. 
these slider puzzles can become very dangerous. That's okay. They're also usually kind of simple. <laughs> Look, see, it, it really wasn't that hard. Okay, a tides puzzle. Alright, so if I go this way... Sweet! Cool! Nice water attack, has a chance of burning. 80 base power, I wanna say. Not bad. Doosh, doosh, doosh. I have no idea where I'm going, by the way. Wait, you have no idea? Not at all, actually. <laughs> I would go as far to say that I am clueless. <laughs> Have I been here before? Because <laughs> I did just find Kyogre in the middle. I thought this game was about Groudon. Hang on. <laughs> you just hang on one moment. Sir? Sir? <laughs> Way to go. Alright. Dang it. <laughs> it's like he's looking directly at me. That guy also has a great question. He's like, who are you? How'd you get here? And I'm like, I do what I want. That's not a good enough reason. Dude, this is a military installation. Uh, first off, you're not part of the military. And secondly, this is an installation. This is a random thing that you decide to drill with a laser somehow. And we didn't drill it with a laser. What? We drilled it like any other normal person would. And then a laser came out, okay? I don't see what the big deal is about everyone saying it's a laser. The laser part wasn't our fault, but it really helped. Because it gave us this gigantic tunnel to the power source. Which was a double-A battery. Uh, double-A? <sighs> Sorry. A double-A battery. Yes, a double-A battery. First off, I respect you for actually having a wheezing instead of a coughing. And secondly, a double A battery. Yes, it was a double A battery. I don't see why you're freaking out so much. Seems highly suspicious. Suspicion raised. <laughs> Your suspicion isn't a little meter. Yeah, it is. I see. I remember this puzzle. Yeah, totally. by one. Probably not. Not. So now I'm bothered that's not symmetrical. <laughs> I see lava. That makes sense. <laughs> so another Zuba. Why would I want another Zuba? Wait, hang on. This is lava on a really dramatically long path, right? Right. So that means it's going to be Groudon, right? Right. So what moves do I have on a Groudon to weaken it and not kill it? Um, I got nothing. Yeah, so here's my plan. I'm going to save. And then if I need to, I'm just going to cheat and shuffle through. Yes. Sweet, what's this? False swipe. Oh. Alright, alright, alright. Before we begin, you hear the distance now to unleash the wrath of Groudon. Now that I've fully caught him and trained him. You down there, hang on. Wait, what? Stop your horses. And your Volkswagen. 
No, no. I need to figure this out first. And then I'll want Earthquake to close the cave. Ew, you just suffocated like 30 innocent workers we were just using to dig this place. So that we could get the Pokemon. They're completely innocent people that we kidnapped. Oh no. Uh, Ghislaine? Yeah. They're not lying, are they? No? No, I don't think they are. <laughs> Just like, <sighs> mm. Yeah, I don't know who to send in front now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, snap! Drown ya! <laughs> How pathetic you appear now, the fool, Archie. Ugh, Maxi, you! Just in case. Like, what are you writing in your journal? Nothing. Dramatic close. Ah, oh, sounds dramatic close. Flaw! Okay. <laughs> Sir, are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Is it back spasm? I, I think I'm fine. L little scamp. Even I, the great Maxi, have found myself wishing for something I cannot justify. And the illogical desire that I harbor was to have you present here at this moment. Ah, now that the fool's wish has come true. Fantastic, nothing completes me more. I suppose I shouldn't make introductions. I present to you my incomparable partner who will assist Team Magma in driving humanity forward to his next level. Wait, hold on, you're not- you're in incomparable? Shut Max. Super ancient Pokemon, Groudon, behold! This great form slumbered in defiance or even the boy they love us surrounding it. Kick. Ooh, lava. Problem solved. <laughs> I did it. Dot, 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 red arrow. So long have I waited for this day. Where's Tabitha? <laughs> Where's Courtney? I think you pushed her in the pier last time. Immeasurably long. How old are you? That's measurable. <laughs> This foolish world has held back human has held back humanity's progress out of misguided idealism regarding the coexistence of humans and Pokemon, but this ancient creature could bring that to its rightful end and create a new land upon which humanity may stride freely forward. How? You're you're really just making more land and controlling a super weapon. That's not gonna do all those things. Now that I have at last obtained the power of Primal Groudon! And now as we are the as you are the final obstacle remaining between me and my goals, I'm just like what? It behooves me to behooves be be dehooves me to use every tool my soul to eliminate. Indeed, even Mega Evolution. See that little stone right there? Right here. Uh, I, I, I mean, other people could use Mega. I want everyone to use Mega Evolution. <laughs> the other guy's just like. Dude, I'll back you up if you need it. Whew. Leader Max. Sent how mighty. I still don't care. Oh my goodness, he has four Pokemon. That's more than like anything I have encountered. How does that make you feel? Are we standing on lava? Alright, Kalei, you're gonna make as far as we can and then I'm just gonna. You're going to make it as far as you can, and then we're going to send in Mega Agron. Next question! Who's <laughs> like, uh, we, we easy. Next question. That, that wasn't bad. Yeah, where'd it go, Hasbro? Play rough? No. No. No, <laughs> Nice. It's been a long time. You're not my crowbat! And don't pretend to be! Shing! That was actually your crowbat. I stole it from the- Oh no! Oh well. Can't be helped. You just mercilessly killed your like your original crowbat. Alright, I bet I can survive the first attack. Uh, no you can't. I bet I can. Did they actually just say Maxi's glasses? 
snap. Does it have legs? Yes, it has legs! Boing! Yep, called it. Called it. I should be able to burst through this thing's massive defenses. I also like how it literally just looks like a volcano with a head sticking out. And the fact that it has an M on his head. An M for Magma. <laughs> See, if I, I, if I close combat, I use close combat. So. Psycho cut! Random hand signs. Oh snap, I did it! <laughs> I didn't actually think I was gonna get away with that! Yeah, I need Jask! Yeah, it's Ah, oh, there's that face again. Nice. You are way harder than most gym leaders. I just want you to know that. <laughs> and furthermore, I just sweeped you with one Pokemon. Ah. Splendid. I was like. No, it is more than that. I should be calling you my young hero. Believing until the very end that world where humanity and Pokemon coexist must be the best. Rejecting my ideals without a second thought. Yeah, I, I don't, I'm just killing things. What if I don't even believe in your ideals? Furthermore, why don't you have a second Mega Stone here? I do that. Be like, double Mega Evolution. There's like no difference. Yeah, but it makes me feel better. Yes, watch you so desperately to halt the beginning of the world's end. You're undoubtedly a hero. So noble that I think I'm going to use this primal ground on each your lunch. The dream for the world's next step four will never change. I'll use the red orb to awaken ground or revert it to its primal form. Withdraw the red blue orb. <laughs> oh, dude! <laughs> and pull an end. And pull an put an end to all else. Wait, Maxi, I'm your girlfriend from 30 years ago. It's going to change your ideals. I really hope you're not his girlfriend. No. 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 Fall in a ditch. <laughs> I don't have failed to realize you were after my spot. No, I don't know. Whatevs. I actually want to see this. Yeah, I actually. <gasps> see, at this point, we should shoot Max. Oh, they make a run for it. Bloody cowards. You guys suck. Like, actually. I'm actually kind of interested in this. No, seriously, I would just punch him. Just be like, no! <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, snap! Alright. We're not gonna just kill that thing. We're gonna catch it! Wait, hang on. This is new. Oh, look at that smile! <laughs> He's like, ah, snap, son! Well, this ain't good. Is he increasing the power of the sun? Or is he, like, changing the atoms in the atmosphere to, like, make it more intense? I'm walking on sunshine. Oh, walking on sunshine. Air. Well, that just happened. And he still laughs like that. So I gotta go kill that thing, right? Hang on, guys. I gotta take this text. Hello. A message for our members outside. Dude, we just got eaten by a giant monster. I'm calling you from inside its stomach. Which is actually quite cozy. Actually. So the sun is turned mercilessly fierce in its heat. I should expect so. This is what I have long know, what we have long wished for. What? The heat is greater than simulations predicted? That's what you wanted. It'll be our risk to our own safety if it continues. Are we gonna turn to Mars? That cannot be. It is only just awoken. Where is it gaining so much power from? Kryptonite. So Kryptonite had it! Then how much more will it gain when it do undergoes primal reversion? C continue your readings, then report back! Boss? Maxi? What just happened to the- I'm sick of hearing that guy. 
All that matters is that I've used the red orb to awaken ground on, and now I'll transform this planet to a land ideal for humanity. Hey, Maxi, what if it's already ideal for humanity? Shut up! Looks like we underestimated the power of the super ancient Pokemon, the power of primal reversion. So, when does Kyogre get into this? Primal ground brings about an end, alright, but you can't, you don't get to choose one end. It's gonna drive away every living thing on this planet to its death. The only thing waiting for us is despair, despair we can't even run from, and despair that's gonna crush humanity. You blessing fool. And that's all happening because you're cocky enough to think you can control the super ancient Pokemon's power that is trying to kill everyone. So the Western Institute we received from the weather. So the information from the Western Institute. Shiba, 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 shiba. And I'm just standing over here like, I wanted to kill him. You all stopped me, but I wanted to kill him. <laughs> Boss Maxi, you're an idiot. We'll never get anywhere to stay around here like this. There's a moment to spare. You must confirm the situation on the outside. They go outside. My eyes, it burns. Child, you're coming too. I don't got to take any nonsense from you. I kicked your butt on like five different occasions. He's like, mm -hmm. what have I done? Why can't there be any villains that are, like, in the end correct? And they still just like, yeah, I'm still right. I didn't lie to you guys once. Dude, this me lava. Dude, this couch is really hot. I, want, I wanted to make... It was supposed to be a world where the human race would attain new heights. Next stage of our development, it was all for humanity's future. Boss. Maxi. Stop calling me Maxi! I'm boss to you. So this is the power of the super ancient Pokemon. This is how ground brings everything to an end. Like... All of us people in Pokemon, every living thing on the planet, everything's gonna die. Okay, little scamp. We're setting sail for Pseudopolis. That blast ground is no doubt gonna get there ahead of us. He'll be waiting for us deep in the cave of origin there in Pseudopolis. There's a pool of energy there that folks say is needful for primal revolution. River, whatever. There's no doubt in my mind that crowd will be racing that cave, thirsty for that power. We got a choice but to go ourselves. We gotta do whatever we can to fight back. There's also a McDonald's on the way, and I'm really hungry. Alright, Maxi, you team Mango Blighters better come with us because you guys are totally worthless. We're responsible for this mess, this ridiculous, impossible mess. No makes sense for us all to step up and clean up after ourselves. Agreed? Uh, whatever. I still don't trust you because I know you're the main villain in the other game, so you can shove off as well. Right. Every hand on deck. Wait, so you're not gonna just take me there? You're just gonna leave me? What? Woo! <laughs> take my hand! You got it! I was honestly expecting it to be like Latios. Max! My bird Pokemon just ran away from me! <laughs> Terrible. This one is being depicted at Painting Granite Cave. If this is stop, all ho no, the entire world will burn up. Like all the way back in South Dakota. And this morning, no, 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 the entire sky is turned red. Scared by the sky red. Nothing can live in such a land of death, neither Pokemon nor humans. This dreadful place, it must be caused by this sweltery heat wave formed above Sutopolis. Come on, Steven, think, what are you going to do? We can go to Sutopolis. No. There's no point agonizing over such a mirror. I have to go to Sutopolis. There must be answers there. Hey, dude, take me. Take me. Now I'm going to do something reckless. He's like, he flew up, he cooked a little bit, and came back down. So, you gotta take me to Pseudopolis? No? Yeah, okay, fine. Where's Pseudopolis? Now, according to my mini-map, that's Pseudopolis. And there's a- uh, Dude, the Pokemon League! Can we go there? No, you have to defeat the gym leader in Pseudopolis first. Gym leader? Yes, you have to defeat the gym leader. The world's at danger. I think we can wait. This sunlight is so sunny. I just, I just can't even. It's so sunny. Stop it. All right. So the next episode, we're gonna head down to Pseudopolis and try to capture us a ground on. So see you then.